Analysis and Use of Figures of Speech Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Connect Plus. Now let's discuss figures of speech. A simile is a figure of speech that makes a comparison, showing similarities between two different things. Unlike a metaphor, a simile draws resemblance with the help of the words, like or as, therefore it's a direct comparison. Like, her cheeks are red like a rose, or he is as funny as a monkey. What about personification? Personification is a figure of speech in which a thing, an idea, or an animal is given human attributes. Ampezi said the sea. The poet personifies the sea and makes it talks. Metaphor. The poet gives something the image of something else. For example, her tears were a river flowing down her cheeks. Therefore, the metaphor is a creative way of saying that the person is crying a lot. And what about contrast? Contrast, the poet uses the words and their opposites to assert the meaning. For example, blowing here and blowing there. And Alliteration is a term to describe a literary device in which a series of words began with the same consonant sound, like wait and you will see the grain. Now let's discuss these definitions. Poetry, it's a beautiful use of language to express our feelings. Poet, the person who writes poems. Poem, verse, the line written by the poet. Stanza is a group of lines in the poem having the same idea. Now let's discuss the meaning of these words. Continents, large land masses, grain, wheat, rice, etc. Planets Earth, Mars, Venus Task Job Vain Useless Toiler Worker Fellow Friend Day by Sir Cecil Spring Rice. I am busy, said the sea. I am busy, think of me. Making continents to be. I am busy, said the sea. I am busy, said the rain. When I fall, it's not in vain. Wait and you will see the grain. I am busy, said the rain. I am busy, said the air. Blowing here and blowing there, up and down and everywhere. I am busy, said the air. I am busy, said the sun. All my planets, every one. No, my work is never done. I am busy, said the sun. Sea and rain and air and sun. Here's a fellow toiler one, whose task will soon be done. Day by Sir Cecil Spring Rice Paraphrase The poet wrote about some of the world's most wonderful workers and how busy they are. When we have finished our task, they will be still hard at work. The poet says that he is a fellow worker. Unlike the sea, rain, air and sun his task will soon be done because he will die one day. His work is not as important as that of the four elements. Commentary The rhyme scheme is A, 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 B, 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 
C, 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 D, 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 D. Each stanza begin in the same way with the same statement, I'm busy. A clear, easy comparison is made. The poem consists of five verses or stanzas. Questions 1. What's the theme of the poem? The poet writes about the work of the four elements of nature and compares it to the man's work. The work of nature will never finish while the work of man ends because he will die one day. Two. What are the figures of speech in the poem? In the poem the poet personifies the four elements of nature as if they were people who can talk and have jobs to do. This is clear and I'm busy, said the sea the poet uses the alliteration and said the sea The poet uses contrast in here there and up down. Three. In what way is the man different from the elements of nature according to the poet in this poem? The work of man will finish one day because he will die while the work of nature will never finish or come to an end. 4. Quote the lines that show A. The work of the elements of nature I am busy said the sea. I am busy think of me. Making continents to be. I am busy said the sea. I am busy said the rain. When I fall it's not in vain. Wait and you will see the grain. I am busy said the rain. I am busy said the air. Blowing here and blowing there. Up and down and everywhere. I am busy said the air. I am busy said the sun. Oh my planets everyone. No my work is never done. I am busy said the sun. B. The comparison between man's work and that of the elements of nature. Sea and rain and air and sun, here's a fellow toiler one, whose task will soon be done. What is the main idea of the poem day? The work of nature is important and it does not end but the work of man can be finished. What is the work of the sea according to the poem day? Land. What is the work of the rain according to the poem day? It helps the plants to grow. Write from your recitation the lines that show the importance of air. I am busy said the air. Blowing here and blowing there. Up and down and everywhere. I am busy said the air. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Connect Plus.